explosive potential is ahead for Ace Bar. What do you think? Does it look like it from the chart? It looked like it had a small potential to actually have a breakout moment, but it actually failed in Ace Bar right here at this resistance area that we talked about on our last video, which was on September 8, 2023. We told you that as long as Ace Bar price stays below five and a half cents, that we're going to look for the market to go down. And since this day, look at this, September 14th, price has done nothing but what exactly gone down so we're actually on par to see our price prediction come to fruition now when we did this price prediction you guys can see that our initial idea was for market to go lower and hold this 0 0.047 cent and it did that i'm quite sure that's one of our targets area off the video go back and see it to see if we had this as a price target because if so that would have garnered us around what 7.14 percent profitability right there and they said that you can't do this. Now, one thing that's causing me concern about this explosive potential for Ace Bar is the fact that we saw all of this volume come into the market in Ace Bar. Look at that volume right there. That definitely tells you that someone sold their Ace Bar in the market. And it just wasn't like one retail trader. No, this was an institution. This was somebody with a bag of Ace Bar. Maybe it was the founders of Ace Bar coming in and selling their Ace Bar into the market. But that definitely is not going anywhere fast. That's why the market has been so reluctant since then to go up. Let's look at Ace Bar on a two-day chart. Okay. What do you think about this? Does it look bullish? I mean, in the next 13 hours, if the market and Ace Bar close on the low like it is right now, I have to suspect that price is still weak and that I'm going to look for it to come back down. Now, we may see it hold a second time 0 0.047 cents, which is another key area to let us know that ace bar is gaining momentum is becoming more bullish okay so let's look at this on the three-day chart i don't like the three-day chart either in terms of bullishness in terms of its strength there's weakness still there so i think i'm kind of finished with my video already i'm not going to change my idea i think that price in ace bar is still weak i think that it's going to go a little bit lower and if it still holds 0 0.047 that's great you know because it shows us that the market buyers are down here willing to buy this currency but if they don't hold 0 0.047 we already have a next area which is down here around four and a half cents ultimately 0 0.043 okay so let's just see what happens but in terms of what trend the market currently is on in ace bar it's trending more or less like sideways trading consolidating trading in a channel and there's still a little bit of weakness there on the chart so that is what i'm supposing the market is feeling at this moment the sooner that we find the buyers the better for us to see that explosive potential continue to be seen off the chart but it's not here yet not from my perspective now you all may see something totally different off the chart you guys may use some other type of technical indicator to harness the idea that ace bar is becoming more bullish so for me i'm finished i'll give you all your time back i'm not here to waste your time i simply want to show you how you can come in see what's been going on in the market and see whether or not the market is bullish or bearish and currently looking at the chart for ace bar the market definitely still looks a little bit bearish. I'm not going to say it's overly bearish. I'm not going to say that it's massively weak, but there's still some weakness here in this currency, though. So I just want to see how low it's going to go. And if it hits that 0 0.047 again and the buyers hold that price, I may have to come back in and do another price prediction looking for the market to ace bar to begin its ascension. We'll talk about it at that time, though. I'm finished. To those who are new, welcome to the channel. This is what I do. I come through, look at the price chart, get a sentiment of what the market is actually thinking, what direction the market has the easiest place to move, and we just simply drop a price prediction, and we see what happens. If you guys want to learn more, hit that like button, stay ready to also subscribe, make sure you maintain the profitability, and as always, trade different.